85-61 win for Kennesaw State over Gardner-Webb. Nathan McCurry and Coach Amir Abdur-Rahim. And, Coach, your very first win yep. uh, over Division One opponent, Kennesaw State. How you feeling? Uh, you know, I feel good. I'm more happy for the guys more yeah. than anything. Um, you know, we, we've had some – you know, some stuff kind of, you know, hit us. And, sure. I mean, that's kind of part of it. You know, we Terrell Burden gets a concussion against FIU, so he's in protocol, not able to go tonight. Right. Find out some uh, unfortunate news with Armani Harris and still waiting on some more back, but didn't have him tonight. You're talking about your leading scorer and your leading rebounder. And then, um, you know, we're going to build our program on character and accountability. Right. And, you know, we didn't have three other guys, uh, you know, for, for, for uh, reasons, you right. know, kind of just kind of detrimental to the team. But I tell you this, the seven guys that we had out there tonight were the right seven, and they were locked in, and it was one heartbeat, it was one mind, right. it was one goal, and, I mean, it was just it was, it was was thrilling for them because they believed in what we talked about. As we roll highlights, mm -hmm. you, this team, you had seven dressed. You right. knew that coming in. This is a 2018 Big South Champion tournament team yep. from a year ago. Um, obviously, you, you, you know that you can play with this team. Right. You came in with a game plan, and it seemed like it clicked immediately. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, I, I'll be honest with you. Uh, Bobby Crimmins uh, used to be the coach at Georgia Tech, yeah, yeah. and he used to be the coach at Charleston. And, and they said he would only recruit seven guys, right, because he didn't want to have to worry about playing time. Sure. And I think what tonight was more than anything, and this we got to carry it over once we get back to full strength, it's to where they play with a free mind. Yeah, you know, yeah. like I tell them all the time, like tell, like somebody tell me who I've told not to shoot the ball. You know, and we want them shooting the ball. We just want them taking good shots. And tonight, in a sense, they didn't have a choice, so they had to let it go, yeah, right? Yeah. And um, and we got to bottle that up and bring it back to when we're with full strength. But, I mean, I can't say enough about Tyler Hooker tonight right. to play, tw play 40 minutes, 27 points, seven assists, six uh, – Six uh, rebounds and the two and two turnovers. I mean, yeah. that's unbelievable. And he's playing. He's starting to play like the senior leader that we act. We need him to. Too. And same with Bryson Lockley. And I tell you, a guy who doesn't get a lot of praise a lot of times, but you you go Beneke. You know, he started the game out. He struggled, and we just keep talking to him about being confident in himself, yeah. believing in himself. And he did an unbelievable job of it tonight of bouncing back. That's the type of guys we, we need in our program. 19 points for Obaniki and yep. aggressive basketball. Yes. He was physical. No, he was. And, and at 6'7", and with his frame, and he's only going to get stronger, we're telling him, man, you got to attack the basket, yeah. right? And I'm telling you, our last – three games he's had highlight real dunks where he makes his mind up I'm gonna drive the ball I'm gonna dunk the ball yeah. and he does or he gets fouled so we, we we've done a good job our staff and and I can't praise them enough they've done a good job of remaining positive with these guys they've done a good job of remaining positive uh you know with me right? yeah, just sure. pulling pulling through and that's the thing that I love about just what we're building here uh, at Kennesaw State, and we just got to continue to grow, continue to build our character, and, and continue to hold each other accountable. And if we do that, we'll have a lot more outcomes like this. You know, we're, we're happy about it, but we're not satisfied. It's more to go get. 18 team assists, 42 rebounds. That's a plus eight. Yep. Um, so impressive. It's good basketball. Yeah, yep. And I, I think, you know, that's an area as we go forward. We're, we're focused on our rebounding right yeah. now. And I think the last four games, I think we've out-rebounded our opponents. I could be wrong, but I'm almost sure of that. And so we're putting the emphasis on, on our on our defensive rebounding. We're putting the emphasis on our three, fours, and fives, getting to the offensive glass. Um, and it's helping us. Yeah. Now, you know, the 18 assists, that's the one I've been waiting on all year, you know, and the six turnovers, yeah. you know, the, Unreal. That, those two at halftime, right? And those are the type of things that we need to have happen, you know, to, for us to grow and be who we can become. Because I, I mean, again, I, I've said it at my press conference, I've said it a number of other times. This is a place that it, that can win, yeah. you know. But we're going to build it the right way. We're going to build it with high character kids, guys that have, that want to be held accountable, guys that can hold each other accountable. And uh, I think the wins will continue to come, but we got to be great in those areas, the, the accountability, the character, and holding each other accountable. If we do that, I, I'm fine. We'll be, we'll be perfectly fine. Congratulations on your first Thank Division you. One win. Thank you. We got a glimpse of what you're bringing to this program. Those yep. of us who bleed black and gold, Absolutely. we're excited about it. Owls win, owls win, owls win. Follow this basketball program at ksuowls.com. Thanks to the fans as well. That was a great, no great crowd. No doubt, great, great crowd. atmosphere. Yep.